Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. P squared in it. Ah. Yeah. T. P. Next. What is left of what is right? These villains in the land of prejudice, seated in terraces, funding their devils, painting innocent faces with feces from Boko Bomb ish. Insult added with salt upon injury and with lavish in abject penury. Still, we are giants of Africa in ironic luxury. Heroes are compelled to romance prison plus for no reason in particular. Villains and their powers flit, wine and dine in ivory towers, and bored by prospect destruction politicians. What is left of what is right? Rapper Ayo, sorry, Papa Ayo, ah, Eshe buys a $10 million private jet, hires it to FG for ammunition without fidgets. What then is right of what is left? Bouncing babies, better than missed bruises. Bright, brilliant, beloved beauties. Now, butchered like barbecue, born silly by beastly bastards bombing baboons. <laughs> Book haters, claiming Boko Haram goons. Only in cartoons can one act with sword boom, boom, kaboom, affront, venting vengeance on vulnerable victims, molding men into modern machines, yet sentencing soldiers saving souls as super beings for reacting against secreted souls, saved by their superiors. What is left of what is right? Moko arises our chaos with our ruthless flight, and our IGP, the supposed Inspector General of Police, backs a national award dressed in brocades and laces, gorgeously bright, despite gory sights of lives battered in shattered sights. Oh, villain Jemisi gets a pat on the back and shoulder, discharged and acquainted for rediscovering and reinventing wings and feathers for pounds and dollars to fly in billions and trillions, like birds of the feather. What is left of what is right? Oh. What is left of what is right? Arise, O compatriots, Nigeria's call obeys. To uphold the honor and glory is vain. Let's keep discovering and rediscovering, inventing and reinventing wings and feathers for pounds and dollars to fly in billions and trillions like birds of the feather, cause it pays. For what is left of what is right? It's jet bombers, impeachment orders, bomb letters, empty promises of shelters for our heroic 1980 football players plus death sentences for pathetic but patriotic army officers. But one day, Mr. Revolution 3 shall bear fruits. Ballot boxes tell truths, right, right wrongs in full. Three men no longer stand in twos. Pot-bellied fools with their tools into the abyss. And then our dear country, Nigeria, shall be peaceful. Repeat.